so forth. So there, are, there is, uh, there are zombies who uh, you know, come back from the other side with more motivation than just taking bites out of people. That's good to see. And the
vampires online. <laughs> 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 I think at least one from that we will you know, our plans do. Yes, I would like to say that you do all have better hygiene, so we're very excited <laughs> <laughs> But we have left several fleas here. <laughs> <laughs> and we'd like to keep it that way. <laughs> I mean, it's nice to me they're actually arguing one of our things about the zombie versus vampire smackdown is we actually didn't discuss our terms. Uh, in terms of, so, so you're saying you're arguing from the point of view of basically who's got to win the war. Uh, <laughs> Thank you. I keep getting in such a big room. And this is how the zombies win. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like that line, damn it. <laughs> When we were organising this panel, I used the word organised very, very loosely, I think. We actually, when I say terms, I say things that are illegal things, but actually, on, on what basis we were going to have zombies versus vampires. And I think possibly the, uh, if you're going to talk about who's likely to win, to win the war, you know, you've, you've got one type of case, and then you've got the, the case of who do you think you're more interested to read about, that might be a different case of, and totally subjective. There might be, which one would you like to be? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's a great The zombies, the zombies, the zombies, the zombies, the zombies, you get to choose. Who chooses zombies? Who chooses vampires? Well, <laughs> if this is the case, how come I'm not reading about all these vampire wars? Occurring in the city of Dolores, and the vampire plant mob. Things are not happening. When I was at San Diego Comic Con a few months ago, I did not see several thousand vampires walking the street. I saw several thousand zombies there. But what's the jury today? I think it's probably because the hurting cat metaphor actually applies not better to vampires than it does to zombies, who do in fact shop all that. Whereas vampires are all very concerning and individual. Vampires are all flying silently over the city in the dark of night. <laughs> yeah, in yeah, Melbourne in night you get stabbed. Oh, it's been it doesn't mean they weren't there. Oh, something I just thought of is that if we're talking about vampires from the historical aspect, they're dead from the way down. Just throwing that out there. Ah, hang on. Basically, I'm not saying that it's a good thing because it's not, but you can do erotic uh, poet, uh, literature about vampires, about okay, zombies. Yeah. And yet, we fall off in the middle of the vampire, but with a, a, a zombie, there's a risk of important part to fall off. Can I make a comment here? Sorry. In, in the real world, in Japan, not so long ago, there were, for reasons that I can't remember and probably don't want to, but first there was a penis transplant uh, of a Japanese man who had lost his own and got a donut penis. It was all things on the And he and his wife were then saying that uh, although it was technically functional, the thought of using somebody else's uh, equipment uh, during their marriage was too distracting, mm. so the uh, operation was a failure. So I can see on that, on the basis of that, the zombie form probably not the best idea. And then there's a problem of the issue. Oh, it's all in the zombie. Oh, and what the issue? There is one other aspect of zombie fiction which has been forgotten, which is often in a fantasy story, a wizard will need an army of disposable mooks. He raises a horde of zombies. Okay, so zombies, zombies are the. Um, yep. <laughs> well, you, you may call it disposable. I call it the weapon of choice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the vampires are not the period that we're raising. Are we the vampires? Instead, I'd much rather have flying monkeys. <laughs> <laughs>
A zombie is the chief lawyer in Terry Pratchett. Yeah. Because there are some things even vampires won't do. <laughs> <laughs>